This video will show you how to set up Gradescope through Canvas and create a place to upload bubble sheet exam responses from students in order to add them to the gradebook. Feel free to pause this video or go back at any point if you need to. To get started, go to your Canvas Courses module section and press the plus sign at the top right. Make sure Assignments is selected in the drop-down bar next to Add and then click Create Assignment and give it the proper name. Then select Add Item. Now you can select the quiz. Once your assignment is created, press Edit at the top right. Here you can adjust the desired amount of points you'd like and any other settings you wish to have. Scroll down to Submission Type and select External Tool. Hit Find, and then scroll until you see Gradescope. Make sure to click Gradescope, then select. Once you've selected it, make sure to check off Load This Tool in a new tab. This is for reliability and security. Scroll down and hit Save and Publish. If you do not wish to publish at this time, press Save and publish the assignment once you're ready to post grades to Canvas. Select Load Whatever Your Assignment Is in a new window. This places you in the Gradescope online system. If it's your first time using Gradescope this semester, select Link with the new Gradescope course and then Link Course. Here you can make any adjustments or changes you'd like. Scroll down and select Update Course. Now we can sync Gradescope with the roster in Canvas. To sync your roster, click the Roster button on the left-hand side. And then select Sync Canvas Roster. Make sure to uncheck letting the new users know that they were added to the course. And then Sync. Now you should see all of your students from your Canvas course in your Gradescope course. Next, we can create assignments in Gradescope. To create an assignment, click Assignments on the left-hand side, and then Create Assignment. For this example, we're going to be using Bubble Sheet. Then click Next. Enter the same assignment name as seen in Canvas, and then under Who Will Upload Submission, make sure to keep Instructor selected. And then Create Assignment. Here you can fill in the answer key and adjust each question to the amount of points they'll be worth. Remember, students must use the 200 questions template, which can be found here. You can also access the bubble sheet template following this link. If you require 100 questions or less, print only the first page single-sided. For more than 100 questions, print double-sided or two pages. Then click Save. Now that the answer key is saved, it's time to upload the student's work. Here's an example scanning each of the bubble sheets in the Fit Center and turning them into one singular PDF. Once you've turned the assignments into a PDF, it can be uploaded. Now select Manage Submissions. If Gradescope couldn't match the correct name to the submission, you can adjust it manually. Now select Grade Submissions. If there are any uncertain marks, make sure to adjust them to match the student's response. Here I can see that the student didn't want to select D and meant to cross it off. So I'm going to uncheck it so that C is the only answer. Confirm all marks and then review grades. When you review grades, you will see several options. Do not publish grades because it shows the students the answer key. 
use Post Grades to Canvas. If you see this pop up, press Edit, and then hit Link Assignment. Be sure to select the correct assignments, and then Save. Now we can go back and repress Post Grades to Canvas, Post Grades. Once we see this, we can close, go back to Canvas, and then go into Grades to make sure they've uploaded. The grades are synced here, and now we're all set.